everyone, thanks so much for stopping by. This is Gina, the online biz expert. Today's short video is to show you how to hide the list of email addresses when you're sending out a bulk email using Outlook. So let's jump right in. Of course, the first thing you want to do is open up a new email, which I've done here. Um, you notice here, you have to have an email address in the to field. So what I normally do if I have to use this for any reason is put one of my email addresses in there. That email address will be seen by everyone on the recipient list. So make sure it's an email, you don't mind having it on display, okay? Now the next thing we want to do is we want to go over here and if you look up at the top, you should see a bar and one of the things that you're going to see is something called options. And just below it, and this might be slightly different in um, later versions of Outlook, but it should be very similar. And you want to look for something that says Show BCC. And this, as you know, is carbon copy. So a BCC is a blind copy, meaning that it's going to be copied to the list, but it'll be done so, so the other people will not be able to see everybody that it's going to. So if you click on that, what you get is another field right here. So you can use this field and this is where you want to put that list of email addresses that you're sending the email to. So I've set one up over here already and I've created a, a list called Gina's Test List. So in this list, I think I may have four or five email addresses and um, I'll just show you exactly what happens when you use this method of sending it out. So I'm going to hit send. Then I'm going to go to my inbox and try to speed it up a little bit. So there's the email that just came in. And as you can see, I'm the only one that's showing up in the two box. There's nobody showing up in the CC box. And so now they can't see everybody that's on that list. So I've protected my list of recipients from being on display for everybody else. So thanks so much. And that's a very quick down and dirty version of how to do that. If you think this email, I'm sorry, if you think this video can be useful to other people, please feel free to share it. And if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, please hit the subscribe button anytime. And again, thanks so much for stopping by and I'll see you on the next video. Bye!